Hello there, I'm here to show you how to test your Monomoto unit before you use it every day on your motorcycle. The first thing you must do is take the little key fob and put it at least 50 metres away. I'm going to stick this right down the other end of my garden. Once you've moved the key fob away, make sure it's in the open air and leave it for at least one minute. Next, make sure you switch off the Bluetooth on your phone. The next stage is to either get on your bike and give it a test ride or just give it a good move around and a bit of a shake to activate the Monomoto device. Right, that should do, and we just wait. You have to do this part of the test outside because if you're inside a building, things like uh, ceilings, walls, buildings can block the GPS signal and you won't know if the reason for a fail test is because you're indoors or because the Monomoto isn't actually working. After about a minute, you should get a call from the Monimoto device. You can just uh, answer that call, otherwise after about another minute or two, you'll get another call and you can just reject those calls. Give it a little bit while longer and then you'll get a notification on the application giving you a push notification that your bike is moving. After a further five minutes, you should get another notification giving you the exact details of where the bike is located. Now, if the notification you receive is showing the precise GPS location, congratulations, the Monimoto is working exactly as required. Don't forget to save that phone number that you got in your contacts for future reference. I've named mine Street Triple so that I know it's this bike that's calling. If you didn't receive an accurate location, then relocate the GPS device, the Monomoto device, on the motorcycle. The best reception is received when you've got the GPS antenna pointing either upwards or to the sides. Whatever you do, don't install it with the GPS antenna touching a metal surface on the bike. Once you've done that, repeat the steps we've been through and it should now work.